Tonight in Summit County, the town of Breckenridge taking a new approach to solving its housing crisis by focusing on short term rental licenses. Spencer Wilson is our Mountain Newsroom reporter, joins us live tonight. Spencer, the plan voted on last night, of course, won't solve this issue, but it's a step. Karen, there's a lot of different opportunities and options they're going to put into place in order to help solve the housing crisis up here. But this latest plan is to start moving short term rentals out of neighborhoods and closer to the resort. First things first, Breckenridge says it already has too many short term rentals for what it's allowed itself. 2200, we're like 2700. So we need to see 500 units in the entire um, town sell before anybody gets a new license. Once that sorts out, they'll move on to the new phase. Overlay zones as indications of how much short term rentals are allowed in the area. Places right next to the ski mountain or lifts will be zone one and 90% will be allowed to short term rent. Zone two, the historic district will get 50%, which it is already sitting at. Finally, zone three east of Maine in the neighborhoods is being cut down from 30% down to 10% once people sell. We are not taking anybody's license. If you have a license, you keep your license as long as you pay the fee at the start of every year and you get your new license. This really will be by attrition. Mamula says you can't blame short term rentals for all housing and staffing issues in their mountain town. They're not the boogeyman. But it is part of it. Now it's about preserving what people love about Breck. What you don't want is to have a town like this that has a great heart and soul right now. And before you know it, nobody that works here lives here or nobody that owns a business lives here. That's the danger in the end. Now, the mayor said that even though this passed at their last night's session, seven to zero unanimously, there's still one more vote next week before this would go into effect if it does. Live in Breckenridge, Spencer Wilson covering Colorado first.